Now that we finally have Photon, I think the Morningstar is the better weapon to have because it gives a lot of magic attack. Whereas the AP does not give as much. So let's learn everything from AP first and then we'll switch to Morningstar. Sounds like a good plan. Still doesn't have experience here. It takes so long to learn that skill. I hate it. Uh, get dash, my dude. You have nothing else to learn anyways, and you're not done with cross counter, so that's fine. All right, let's get the heck out of here. I hate this place. Not a fan of this dungeon. Hello? Oh, no. Ah, oh, the common rabble. So I finally found you. That's far enough. You lackeys must have had a lot of time on your hands if you crossed the ocean just to see us. <laughs> You're in no position to talk down to the likes of me. Now, princess, right this way. Huh? What does he mean, princess? The princess standing right here in front of us. Y Yuri, but how did you... I mean, it's like one of the most obvious things of all time, Estelle. Like, come on. What? Estelle's a princess? I suspected as much myself. Rita, you too? Wait, you've got to be kidding. And what will happen to my friends? Why, they'll be drawn and quartered for abducting a member of the royal family, of course. Please, wait! I wasn't abduct- Ah, oh, what a mouthy young lady you are. This way, please. Estelle! Now die like the flies you are. Arrest the culprit Yuri Lowell and his accomplices! You! The Swan Brigade! Just a minute. This prize catches mine. I won't let you take him from me that easily. Catch? Our duties are not to be carried out in the fashion of a hunt. <laughs> did I not also hear someone mention dying earlier? You did. What is wrong with condemning criminals to their deaths? Should not criminals be captured and judged in accordance with the laws? <laughs> I suppose I can let you have these little worms. If it isn't Schwan, it's Flynn. These upstart commoners are so full of themselves. Even that commandant. This way, please, your highness. Do watch your step. Um, but I... Yes, right this way. Arrest them! In the name of Captain Schwan! Okay, Yuri Lowell gang, it's curtains for you, I say. What do you mean, gang? H hey, get your hands off me! Do you know who I am? But I haven't done anything! Don't hurt them, I beg you. Estelle, don't worry. Yuri! Just start walking. Walk, I say. Ow! Hey, watch it with the pulling. Sir Schwan, we shall take these undesirables to Heliord. All members, fall out! The actual Captain Schwan himself. Hey, Royal Successor title. Nice. And then she leaves the party, so I can't even use it. I don't understand why Yuri just lets himself be captured here. We can definitely beat those three up. I don't know about Captain Schwan himself, but I assume he could put up a fight. Continuing on, we will review the particulars of your 18th crime. Please do. Is it true that you threw a knight sent to collect the taxes into the river? Wow, I'd forgotten about that. Was that you, Tweedleway? That's right! I was in bed with a cold for three whole days thanks to you. How many more of these are there? This is getting pretty boring. I wonder what'll happen to me. So I'll write, you have no signs of remorse in the report then. Where's that do-nothing captain of yours anyway? What was his name, Schwan? Playing hooky because he's the big shot. You dare mock our captain. 
Sir Schwann is a legendary hero, and a veteran of the Great War ten years ago. So basically, his eminence would never stoop so low as to deal with nobodies like us. Quiet, I say. Quiet! Getting on to your next offense. Your Excellency, Commandant Alexei, to what do we owe this pleasure? Alexei? What? All your crimes are hereby pardoned by the good graces of their highnesses Esteles and Yoder. What? But these foul criminals have disturbed the peace of the Empire! The Imperial Knights thank you for rescuing Prince Yoder and protecting Princess Esteles. Please, take this. We've got no need for this. It's not like we did those things for the sake of the Knights. I see. What about Estelle? She has just given her consent to be returned to the Imperial Capital. What? Well, I guess she is a princess after all. The princess is waiting at the inn. We would be pleased if you made an appearance. I'm on my way then, oh, freaking cooking boy. So. I did find you, yes. Teach me. Fish with miso sauce. Sick. We've done it, boys. Goodbye. I should probably cook more. I never cook. I was so surprised to find out that Estelle was a princess. I had a feeling. She knew Flynn, and she was obviously brought up as a noble. Shut up. You knew already. Maybe. Oh, man. I wonder if I was rude to her without realizing it. Your language has been unpardonable. Captain Carroll, the sentence for insulting royalty is... decapitation. Been nice knowing you. What about you? You're way more rude than I am. Guess it's off with both our heads, then. What? Th that's... Idiots. <laughs> I love Yuri, man. Great character. Ah, I'll remember you, Yuri Lowell. Yeah, good luck forgetting. I'll let you go this time. You have no choice. You better watch it next time. Don't tell me what to do. Bam, 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 bam. Hello. Effort always bears fruit. Persevering until you harvest that fruit is the definition of effort. People put no faith in notions like that and then die in obscurity. Is there a save point anywhere nearby? Throughout history, there have always been two types of people. That's right, the rulers and the ruled. I mean, technically speaking, kind of, yeah. No save points, huh? I just need to get to the end where Estelle is and I can save point there. We still got about ten minutes. We got time. Yeah, I've got time. So Estelle's going back home, huh? You don't have a problem with this, Yuri? It's not my decision to make. Well, I guess that's true, but... More importantly, where are we? This is the city of Heliord. Geographically speaking, it's located between Torum Harbor and the city of Dondrest. It was only just recently built. It's still a very new town. If you follow this road to the east, you'll hit Kerbokram, where we were earlier. Cut through the west and go to the northwest to reach Dondrest. I see. Well, maybe I'll have a look around the town a bit. I've got my own business to attend to. Hmm, what to do? Alright, party with everyone. We're all doing our own thing. The Rising City, Heliord. Alright. What you doing, Captain Carol? Can't go back to the Hunting Blades? What am I gonna do? I think I actually remember what your decision is from, uh... When I played before. Ah, uh, it's not going to let me. I didn't know if that was actually the way out or not, or if I could go further over that way, but... I was thinking, jump onto the field map, save, and then continue. Hello. Is this the town's Blastia? Huh. My boy. What are you guys doing? Almost all of your most important work turns out to be odd jobs. Okay, sure. Weird sentence. Are you worried about something? The best remedy for a worried mind is hard work. Depending on the person. Oh, hey, Flynn and Yoder. Ah, oh, so both of you were here the whole time. Yuri, watch your speech in front of His Royal Highness. You could at least show due courtesy to the gracious partner of your crimes. It's okay, Flynn. Miss Esteles and I acted of our own volition. You've already heard about Lady Esteles, then, I see. 
Yeah, I heard. Yuri, I thought that traveling with you would be to Her Highness's own benefit, but... The royal family can't be allowed to romp all over the countryside without restraint. That's not very convincing coming from you. <laughs> I apologize. But now especially, it's undesirable for the royal family's concerns to be brought into the public eye. Concerns? You mean whether you or the princess is next in line for the imperial throne? Correct. There are currently two opinions. That of the imperial knights, and that of the council. Your highness! There's no use hiding any details from him when he already knows so much. The Imperial Knights are backing my own ascension to the throne. Meanwhile, Miss Estelis has the support of the Council. She's a princess after all. Yes. Her relation may be a distant one, but she's unmistakably of royal blood. That's gotta be tough for the Knights, too. Even if she's the rival of their candidate for the throne, it's not like they can just stop protecting the princess, is it? Yuri, this matter is... I don't know anyone odd enough to be interested in information like this. Well, I'm gonna go drop by Estelise's place, and then I'm gonna take a load off at the inn. Thanks for the chat. Alright then. Have you thanked Lady Estelise and Prince Yoder yet? No. Estelise and I aren't fighting or anything like that, I actually think we get along rather well. Are, you guys, like, aren't siblings, right? You're, like, distant cousins or something? I don't understand fully the problem with the line of ascension here. Also, I don't know where the inn is. Because, like, when Yuri said I'm going to go to the inn, he pointed in that direction, but I didn't see it that way, so let's just keep looking over here, I guess. Oh, this is the end of the place, isn't it? Yeah, it's not going to let me go onto the field map. Well, is is this the inn right here? Uh, it's got a cutscene. Wait, I say! Oh, no. Hey, it's Tweedle A and Tweedle B. Don't call us that! Something I can help you two with? Even if you have a direct pardon from His Highness Yoder, I say that does not change the fact that you committed crimes against the Empire. As members of the Imperial Knights, our honor will not allow us to simply let that slide. So you're going to break the law by attacking me even though my crimes have been pardoned? Yuri Lowell, you will battle with us here, I say, fair and square. If you beat us, we'll recognize you as innocent of your crimes. Don't make claims you can't back up. Since when did you two have the authority to forgive people their crimes? Regardless, we must battle. Battle! If that's what it takes to make you happy, I guess I can humor you. Excellent, come with us. Does this mean I'm about to learn some kind of new skill? Or am I just not gonna follow him and ignore him? No, I'm gonna follow him, okay. Normally when you fight these nerds, you learn something. Some new game mechanic. Kiss your freedom goodbye, for it ends today. I say, prepare to face the Imperial Knight's ultimate fighting technique, the burst art. Oh my goodness, I'm sorry I was yawning. I just woke up like, and then immediately started recording. So I'm still a little, you know, not like asleep kind of, but you know, I'm yawning a lot. But anyways, um, I've only just now realized it, but Atacor, whatever his name is, looks exactly like the shark guy from Mega Man NT Warrior. My goodness, they're actually the same character. Again, you're claiming regular techniques as your own. That doesn't belong to the knights. I say be quiet! The burst art, huh? I've heard of it before, but... You don't know how it's done? You fool! I say we shall show you. But before that happens... You'll be reduced to no more than a worthless caterpillar crawling on the ground! Rah! I say... Rah! Maybe it has something to do with Overlimit. Go! Show him how it's done, Atacor! I say watch me now! The arcane art of the Imperial Knights! It didn't hit him! What are you doing? Huh. Burst arts can be linked from an arcane art. I wonder if I could imitate that. <laughs> There's no way an amateur could do something like that, I say. And now, over limit. I'll blow you away. Ah, be careful. Yuri Lowell's going to attack. Arcane art. Crushing eagle. Trigger a burst start by holding circle after arcane. Okay. I'm holding circle. I'm pressing. Oh, there we go. That's enough for today. 
First heart! I say, what a terrible turn of events! I say, you're dead! You're dead! First hearts, get him. Oh, what? You can just knock people out of their burst hearts? That doesn't seem right. Do the. Okay, never mind. I was trying to use the burst art again. What the heck was that? I want his overlimit to run out. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Now we're talking. Oh, I, like, broke him or something. Ow, ow, ow. Okay, this is annoying. Stop. I hate fighting anything other than one-on-one. -on -one. Leave me alone. Because of stun locking. Dude, like, I hate stun locking. It happens way too much in this game. It's too easy to get stun locked often. Nope. Okay. Stop. Can, oh my goodness. Can one of you die, please? This is so annoying. Tales of games were designed to be done with, like, four people in your party, not just one. Neither of you are dead yet, huh? Like, Atacor is still alive, really. I'll be with you in a second. Because of the way this fight is set up, I kind of got to run and then heal, and then I'll be right back. Oh, come on. Dude, screw off with this. Stop. I'm not dead. I'm clearly right here. This is such a waste of apple gels. I only want to hit Atacor because I want him to die so I can just destroy Boko or whatever his name is. Okay. You are still alive? Dude, what is the... Use the freaking magic lens. How much health can one person have? Why does he have so much HP? Over 10k for this stupid little, like, oh, look, Yuri's fighting the two joke characters. This is ridiculous. He's almost dead, though. Just in Atacor, and then Baco will be a joke. Okay, finally. Now you can't just stun lock me by both of you running up to me at once. Nope. Easy. Can't touch this. Nope. Okay, yeah, that's fair. Totally forgot about server strike. That's not what I thought it would be. I meant to use the right stick one, which is Wolf Strike. Yeah, get out of here. You must have a ton of HP too, but I'm not going to bother using a magic lens on you now. There's no reason. Nope. What are you, uh, yep, there it is. That was more of like a roll attack than a spin attack, but you know, whatever. There we go. That was very annoying. Man, I was just getting warmed up. Decent experience, at least. Man, nothing like some good exercise before turning in for the night. I guess I'll hurry back to the inn. All right, we have the burst art now. The burst arts, there are there mystic arts in this game, or do burst arts kind of like replace mystic arts? All right, this is the end. Please let me save before talking to Estelle. Fingers crossed. Ah, oh, perfect. Thank you. All right, we're going to save and wrap up, boys. That's going to be all for today. Fingers crossed that this session did not mess up or I'm going to lose my friggin' mind. That fight was dumb, though. But uh, anyways, yeah, we're good now. So uh, we got a save point, so we're, we're just fine. But uh, yeah, I think that's everything. Sorry that uh, there were no videos over the weekend of Tales of Vesperia, but like I said, that session messed up, and then I had streams and uh, stuff with my friends and other shenanigans. It's also really hard, especially because I didn't like that dungeon. It's really hard to have like just done something, for me at least, especially in a recording aspect. And then be like, oh, you gotta record the exact same thing you just did. So, it made it a lot easier on me to, like, wait a day or two before recording it again. But, you know. All's well that ends well. Hopefully we don't have any more issues like that. And we can just continue through the rest of the game with no issue. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I'll catch you next time. And until then, farewell.